cold doesn't kill you, the pointy landscape will. say about all work and no play. We could use a hobby or something.
I hoped you would come. Our prior meeting terminated unsatisfactorily. Surrender, and you will be treated well. Resist, and, well, you know the rest. Why take me alive? What does the Emperor want? Even if I could answer you, I wouldn't. I serve my master's will. He doesn't know. He's just following orders. Like a droid. I gave you a fair chance, and you refused it. Men, kill this Jedi. of the Emperor's Fortress. They contain schematics of its entire defense grid. Between this and the cloaking device prototype you recovered on Balmora, we have everything we need to capture the Emperor. I'm not injured or dead. Thanks for noticing. I assumed you'd be fine. You always are. Meet me at the main Republic base. Liha Naraz out. Return to your post. It's a wonder all your men survive such an enemy. How did you defeat the Gendai? Superior tactics, and a dozen thermal detonators. If that Gendai is still alive, I guarantee it wishes it wasn't. We couldn't have done this without you and your men. Your service has been exemplary, Sergeant. You and your men brought the Republic a great victory. The heroes of Hoth. I finally get to meet you in person. General Grain, been a while. Hard to believe you and I started in the same squad. Still a ground pounder, huh? Wouldn't have it any other way. It's honest work, sir. I didn't realize you and the General were comrades. We had some short-lived adventures back during the war. You can hardly tell that left leg isn't real, sir. The medtechs did good work. The 88th Armor Battalion is on its way. The 301st Infantry is being rotated back to Coruscant. I can't waste a soldier like Rusk on shore leave, so I'm assigning him to you. For how long, sir? Until the Sith Empire is defeated. I'm not sure what further need we'll have of him, but he's welcome to join us. If nothing else, he can guard your ship. The transfer is effective immediately. Good luck. My shuttle is small. There's hardly enough room for myself and the Medes. Perhaps Sergeant Russ should travel with you. Be honored to. Look forward to learning from a superior warrior. Excellent. I will deliver these technical readouts to Master Braga. You should contact him as well. May the Force be with you, my friends. I'll requisition my gear and meet you at your ship. Grab a bunk and make yourself at home. As ordered, Master Jedi. 
Welcome home, Master. I hope you find your vessel a model of efficiency, convenience... Master Braga, Liha Nerez is on her way with the technical readouts to the Emperor's Fortress. I knew you two would be unstoppable together. I'm not sure what to make of her notions about droids using the Force. Nor do I. Then again, great advances in knowledge often come after a leap of faith. Your successes on Hoth and Balmora have been nothing short of extraordinary. Our plan to capture the Emperor is already taking shape. Come back to Typhon, my friend. We'll discuss the particulars here. Master Braga out. Master Jedi. The defeat of the Sith Empire is easily the most ambitious mission I've ever been given. In fact, the odds of surviving a battle against the Emperor himself are almost zero. I'm looking forward to this more than any other assignment I have ever had. We're gonna need everything we've got to defeat the Emperor. Understood, Master Jedi. Victory or death. If I may say so, the Jedi Order's discipline, self-sacrifice, and devotion to duty are a model for all citizens. It will be an honor to serve with you. Ah, the life of a combat medic. Long hours, grueling work. Patients bleeding all over your nice clothes. I'm not complaining. Nothing beats the look of gratitude from someone whose life you just saved. But it gets distracting when beautiful patients fall in love with you. I mean, lots of ethical dilemmas, you know? How often do combat medics meet beautiful women? Why do you think I took the job? I figured Jedi have the same problem. You must have admirers lined up from one end of the galaxy to the other. I have billions of fans on Coruscant alone. Just imagine how popular we'll be after we knock the Sith Empire into a black hole. If I were you, I'd get some extra sleep now. You can get along without me for a bit, right? Need to pop over to Alderaan. Old friend of mine there got kidnapped by gangsters. They'll kill her if I don't deliver the spice they paid me for. How can you be so casual about this? Your friend is in terrible danger. Why worry? Old Doc's got everything under control. A couple of years back, I scammed this gang for a bulk load of credits. Spent everything to set up a refugee hospital on Alderaan. My friend is the head doctor there. Uh, I guess the gangsters finally figured out where all the money went. They're holding your friend hostage until you give them their credits. 
or the spice. I'm going undercover for Republic Customs. Once I deliver the spice and free my friend, the good guys swoop in. Gangsters go to prison and my friend gets your hospital back. Whole plan's foolproof. Won't take any time at all. Watch your back, Doc. Someone's always building a better fool. Don't I know it. Those gangsters were smarter than I thought. But the Republic hostage negotiators talked him out of killing me. They were really something. Sounds like the expert on talking finally met his match. I was at a disadvantage. The gangsters really wanted me dead. Good news is, my old friend's fine, because they forgot all about her. We never got a chance to catch up, but, uh, hey, that's her on the hollow. Probably wants to say thanks. Hey, pretend you work for me, all right? You look terrific, Prudy. Have you lost weight? Love the new hairstyle. Two years without so much as a hollow, and that's all you can say. You abandoned me at our wedding. Doc, is this woman your wife? We're just good friends. She's a little confused, that's all. I thought you loved me. You said all those wonderful things on Ord Mantel. Brody, sweetheart. Those were <laughs> sweet nothings. You should never take those at face value. My parents flew all the way from Corson for a wedding that never happened. You loathsome cat. I wish I'd never met you. Whatever happened before, Doc risked his life to save you. I'd never have been kidnapped if it wasn't for him. Look on the bright side, Prudy. You still have that hospital I bought you. The gangsters burned it to the ground. She still loves me. Ugh, those gangsters on Alderaan brought back some great memories. Oh, they used to call me Doc Operator back in the day. I was the go-to guy for everything medical. Trauma kits, surgical droids, hospitals, you name it, and I could get it. One time, this hut was hoarding med packs after a massive ground quake, selling them in an obscene markup. I tricked Mandalorians into attacking his palace. Inciting violence hardly seems like a useful response. How else was I going to liberate those med packs? I forged a death mark signed by the HUD against the Mandalorian clan. They, uh, accidentally found it with a little help from yours truly. The Mandalorians attacked the HUD palace in record time. By sheer coincidence, I was there to sweep in and clear out the HUD's med packs. You expect me to believe that's all you took? I know how HUDs live. The hut was hiding rare gems in a few med packs. Strangest thing. Thanks to an anonymous donor, every hospital in the disaster zone received supplies to treat their patients. Saved thousands of lives. That was small time compared to what we're doing. When we save the galaxy, I'm not staying anonymous. We have got to get off this ship and do something besides beat up bad guys. Don't get me wrong, that's important, but it wouldn't kill us to go out and socialize a bit. I know all the best clubs. I'll show you around, make some introductions. Never know who you might meet. It'll be fun. Lead the way, Doc. Where should we start? Everyone will tell you that Nar is the place to be. But that's just hype. Truth is, hut space is full of boring tourists. If you want real fun, you have to visit the private clubs. They're invitation only. No tourists allowed. Give old Doc some time to work his magic. I'll get us invited to the best club this side of Ord Mantell.